Did you have that in your room? And when you saw the polka dot jersey this morning and putting it on, what was it like? <laughs> uh, yeah, I was just sending pictures to my family saying, look how cool I look. <laughs> you did. You sent some selfies. I did, yeah. <laughs> what does it mean for you to ride in this today? Um, yeah, it's uh, very, very prideful. It just makes me so happy. And uh, yeah, just uh, makes me realize how far I've come from being a little kid watching the tour on TV. With the Carapaz now out, how does it change how the team is going to approach the rest of the race? Um, yeah, I think in general, it doesn't change the team's tactics too much. We still want to win stages. We still want to be aggressive. Uh, that was the case with or without Richie. Uh, the only difference now is we kind of don't have a, a, real, a real GC hope because before we could kind of you know go for three things, maybe polka dots, stage wins, and GC with Richie. But now we just have to, uh, you know, let go of the GC. Milton, how much might those bonus seconds and the fact that, well, Simon Yates, we expect to go for them, other GC riders, how much might that meddle with your ambitions for the polka dot jersey today? Yeah, uh, there's a really good chance that the GC riders are going to snag up those points on Kaiske Bill. So I think we're just going to have to see how big the breakaway is, how the other teams are reacting. I think we're going to know after 10 or 20K. Um, yeah, what the, every team's ambition is going to be. But uh, yeah, I'll be looking around on the, I'll be starting on the front line, so I'll have a, a good overview.